it's great to have new tenants. That there's my son's room. He's visiting with his wife before they go off to Silent Hill for the weekend. He's spoon feeding her breakfast? Aw, that's so sweet. What's he doing with that pillow? Yes, sirree, Bob Henry. We have a nice community here. Low rent, great plumbing, and since it's gonna be a few years before Twitter takes off, the neighbors don't judge too bad if you're a convicted felon. I, I never said I wasn't. How did you know? Everyone who moves here is. Here we are, room 302. Try not to be too loud and don't put dolls in the safety deposit box. Oh yeah, the guy who got brutally murdered here before you was an investigative journalist. So you'll have plenty of paper to write on if you need it. It's been five days since I was trapped in here. The phone doesn't work. The TV doesn't work. Smartphones haven't been invented yet. And reading is... For nerds. Man, I'm so bored. And worst of all, no one can hear me in here. Get a job, you hippie! I'm trying, but I can't get out! <sighs> he walks by my door and says that every day, so I can't tell if he can hear me or not. <sighs> well, time to go jump into that hole in my bathroom. Hey, Tiger. Help me out of here, and I'll give you a special favor. Are you a cop? You have to tell me if you're a cop. What? You're propositioning me, right? Well, it's open to interpretation. Look, I'm down for it, but you gotta promise me you're not a cop. Ugh, <sighs> whatever. I'm not a cop. Bitchin'. I think I'm gonna puke. Gee, why do women always do that around me? Uh, nice doggy. Are you okay? Yeah, Henry. I'm fan fing tastic. <laughs> Yikes. Kinda regret making you wear your alternate outfit now. Wait. What do you mean you made me wear this outfit? End scene. Answer me, you cunt! Breaking news! The body of a cop masquerading as a prostitute has been found in South Ashfield Station. <gasps> when you die in the other world, you die for realsies. Well, back in the hole. So, you c came to investigate this stone t t too. Th there was uh, another g g guy here before. Uh, uh, a real nosy guy. I'm not sitting through all this. So, so yeah. Ah, so you're just a crazy guy. To Got it. I want chocolate milk! You are a grown ass man. Chucky Milk! F*** you. Pay me. You can have a spade. I'll get my own spade. Thank you. Fine. Here's your chocolate milk. Give me that. Ah! 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 Why are you just watching me burn to death? Do something, you dense mother -er! Okay, hang on.
You stupid asshole! Hold still. God, you're so inconsiderate. There's gotta be a trick to this. Back in the hole! Huh. Prison. I'm sure this is gonna be a nice, straightforward segment. I used to work at the orphanage, watching the kids. You're a kitty fiddler? What? No! I was a caretaker! Well, you look like a kitty fiddler. I don't diddle kids, I beat them mercilessly! Wait, wait, what? Look! Scary mushrooms! Son of a bitch! Next time I see him, he's dead! Receiver... Is... is that an offer or a threat? Make it quick. I also think about Dick. A lot. Just like Heather. I do not. It's amazing how quickly I've become desensitized to this. Boop. Why does everyone I meet Die horribly. Strange. I kind of want to kill more people. <laughs> to the hole once more. Henry, this is Super Nintendo Frank Sunderland, father of James Sunderland from Silent Hill 2. Remember, I, I gave you a photo of Silent Hill for some reason. Open up! Is everything okay here? No! This bastard has an eviction notice, and he's blocked the door somehow. And even though this exact thing has happened before, twice, I'm gonna slip a note under the door and consider my duty of care here finished. Sounds spooky. Shame. I was gonna toss him a pity f God damn it. Did you hear that? Nope. Strange. Yes, there are a... Lot of strange things in this world. The umbilical cord I keep in the box in my room? Lately it started to smell terrible. You keep an umbilical cord in your room? Forget I said anything. I kinda can't. You're my superintendent. What is wrong with you? I'm a Silent Hill character. Oh, hey, you're that sex offender that moved into room 302. Shh, not so loud. But yeah, I'm Henry. You're gonna die soon, so I won't bother learning your name. Okay, fair enough. I think I have another scene before I die, though. Yeah, but we're skipping that. Oh. Okay. You can go now. <laughs> you know, you would be a lot scarier if I hadn't heard that exact same sound effect in countless other movies and TV shows. Seriously, this sound effect is the Wilhelm scream of monkey sound effects. <laughs> Well, I tried. Hmm. 
Hmm. Guess I get to watch Eileen die next. Neat! To the hole! This doll. Miss Galvin gave it to me years ago. Here, you have it. And I'd recommend putting it away as soon as you can. You are obviously very Stevie, but I only got like 10 item slots, so I got no choice but to put it in my storage box. Ow. Owie. Aw, oh, gross. I stepped in it. Oh, hey, Eileen. Are you okay? Isn't it funny that I always come just in time to see them die no matter how fast I am? I also turn up quickly too. Semen. Wow. <laughs> I am five for five on f***ing this up. Back to the hole! Ow. Fine, I'll make my own hole. With blackjack and hookers. Ah, the mandatory Silent Hill hospital level. Uh, hi. Well, that was easy. And even though he was literally right behind me, you won't see him again until the forest world. Hey. Hey, wake up. You were acting hysterical. Also, you have the most annoying scream. This gives me an idea. Now kiss. But I... What is the... Why does it moan sexually? I said kiss. Please? <laughs> Shut up, this is supposed to be scary. Okay, follow me. Closely now. Don't lose sight of me. There is no possible way this can backfire. Yay! Now you're trapped in my apartment too! Oh, for fuck. Couldn't I at least have gotten a Silent Hill 2 nurse? <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Wait, hold on. Silent Hill, the room. June 2004. Grudge. 2002. I'm on to you, Konami. Oh look, everybody. Miss Suck for a Buck is trying to be scary over here. You do know ghosts phase through solid objects, right? Finish him! That's what she said. Fatality. Garbage day! Huh? No! Ah! What the f***, Henry? Relax. You're immortal until the final boss. Boo! 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 I'm Ghost Andrew! And I'm gonna- Wait, hold on. Crap. Why would they actually put this mechanic in the game? Hey, buddy, can you give me a hand here? Sure.
I can help you cut off a few pounds. Wait, what are you gonna do with that? Perform a service to humanity. No. No! Ooh, I'm still haunting you! F*** off. Oh. Boy, oh boy, the price of freedom is steep. Where did you get that sword from? Embrace your nightmares, and whatever happens, protect your balls. As Henry, come and get it! And in traditional raccoon style, he's about to be humorously torn to shreds off s- Whoa, holy sh- Okay, I'm done with this bit. Come on, Eileen. Aw, oh, dude, you're getting crap all over my walls. And will you guys shut up? I need a drink. God damn it. Let's get some food. <sighs> I've eaten worse. I'm hungry! I'm working on it! <laughs> what do you want? I'm always watching you. I'm always watching you. Good to know. Goodbye! Now who the hell can that be? I'm Ghost Henry! Ooh, that does it. I'm going back in the hole. Henry, please. It hurts so bad. Please use one of your help kits on me. I have a better idea. Henry, stop dicking around. It's not gonna work if you don't believe, Eileen. Hmm, maybe we need healing crystals and essential oils. I'm gonna guess you're an anti-vaxxer too. You mean government microchip implants? Yeah, no thank you. <sighs> Holy smokes! It's Kurt Cobain! Hello, Mini-Me. Want to go meet Mother? Yeah! Yoink! Later, Henry! Damn. Probably should have done something instead of just watching their entire conversation. Oh man, he's got some bad ping. Dude needs to reset his router. Whatever one of those is. Routers were invented in 1981, dumbass! Do your research! Henry, let me exposition dump on you. You're upside down. Yes, Henry, I can see that. Why are you upside down? I don't know, Henry. Listen to me. If I whack you with a stick, will you break open like a piñata? Do you want to know about Walter and the 21 sacraments or not? Not really. People can wiki it if they want to know. We're not here to recap every story detail. Next scene. Oh my god, what the f***? This body was here for seven years and no one noticed a smell coming from this apartment? It still smells better than Dahlia Gillespie. Whoever that is. Oh, neat. Keys. It's him, Henry. Walter is crying. Boo freaking who? I'm going back, Henry. Back to the room. It's the only way to stop Walter. Pretty sure that's a trap. But you knock yourself out, sweetheart. You're it, Henry. The last of the 21 sacraments. The final sign. The receiver of wisdom. Couldn't you just throw her into the grinder yourself? Or just place her next to it if you needed her to walk into it? Don't criticize my methods, and you're not skipping another final boss fight for comedic effect, Rabtoons. Do the fight properly. Wait, what are you doing? I just want to leave my f***ing room, man. No!
we don't animate fight scenes. Thanks. Guess I'll have to find a new place to live. Nineteen people died violently and will forever exist as ghosts in eternal damnation. This is not a good ending. Dope soundtrack, though. Happy Halloween, everyone! We don't need no explanation. We don't need no rent control. A big ass head keeps staring at Okay, I've done the deed, the car is loaded, I've emptied my apartment, time to drive to Silent Hill. Wait, where's my car? Dear Mr. James, your car has been impounded. You have 48 hours to come and collect it or it will be crushed. <laughs>